There's Jamie from Tipton. Last 16, the last two visits. Three of those five ranking titles came in 2015. The remaining classic Swedish Open and the jersey. And as for Madders, again, last 16 on the last two visits. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. First set, first luck is Jimmy the Trophos. Game on. Good evening, Vassos. Good evening, George. Both these players 42. throw the dart a little quicker than we saw in the last match from Dennis Harbour. So hopefully we should have a nice pace about this. Madars Rasmer got to the first round proper, won one match and lost his second on debut in 2014. And did the same last year, but he started in round one proper. So reached this stage, the last 16. Lost 4-3 to Brian Dawson. And actually made quite a lot of friends along the way. He feels like a regular fixture, the Latvian already. It's only his third lakeside. 42. Not a particularly good start from Jamie Hughes. This is better from Madders, though. One on the end, 14. Jamie Hughes, the fourth seed this year, having won three of his five 82. ranking titles in the past 12 months. This is his second lakeside. He was again, he was seeded last year. And lost at this stage to Glenn Duran. 19. So whoever wins this match will be in uncharted waters. This is better from Jamie. 139. So ball for 15s and tops. There we see, eventually the ball's in there. Treble 15 would have left double top. One of them, 19. Jamie, you require 140. Great last start. This is to hold his throat. He won't now do that. Well, he might now do that, but he won't do it this visit. One of them, 14. Manager you require 16. So, a couple of eights. The Madders Rasma to strike first. And that's been shown in the first line. Madders Rasma. Second line gets Madders to throw first. Yes, beware the Latvian when it comes to the finishing. Didn't play particularly well. Didn't score particularly heavily against Gary Robson in his first well, round match. Madders average just south of 80 but won it with a 150 and hit 67% of his doubles. Well, he didn't have to produce his best ultimately in that one, did he? Did he not? 57. Jamie absolutely destroyed and out of sorts, Ross Montgomery. Shake of the head as Madder strays into the one. Could do with the treble here on the third. Gets it. One. He's looking calm and cool. Yes, I saw him outside the hotel a couple of hours ago. Hang on a minute. 121. A lot of his mates were just in the bar, having a bit of a chat and a beer. He was just sitting on the bench outside on his own for 10, 15 minutes. Just taking One stock of things. 35. And he's enjoying himself tonight. So far, so good for the Latvians. 14. Manager require 155. Not this time. No, no pressure on the throw though. He'd be looking to set something up here. 64.
and he'll have at least six at 91 to hold throw and go two legs clear. One hundred. Manas Uri Kwar, 91. OK, for a two-leg lead in the first set. Jamie, remember, way back on 183. 31. Monitor corner 16. So, two darts at tops for a two leg lead. First set for Madders Rasma. Double 10, or Jamie's coming back. 15. And he is. Team of Uruguay, 43. Twenty-seven. Manners really required ten. Well, you can't give this man this many chances. You'd expect him to take this out the way he's yeah, been finishing. Let's keep with the second line. Manners has come. Furlock is teaming the twelve first. Game on. I mentioned Rasmus finishing in his first round win over Gary Robson. He hit 67% of his doubles, 10 out of 16. 99. He's missed three already tonight, but hasn't been punished. 97. 100. Jamie's overall average at the moment is a lot better than his average for his first nine darts. 81. 41. 100. Plenty at Lakeside. And that is Elima, Madar's girlfriend. We have one on camera too. And who knows how many others? 57. Maybe Latvia is the new darting Holland. <laughs> 63. That's a little bit scary. Another one of those to apply pressure. One Great adjustment. Not as really by 116. Yes. Unlucky. 100. Jimmy, you require 64. So, 64 for Yozza. 16 would leave one dart at double 16. 48. Unable to do so. Manners, you require 16. He's missed that double 16 three times already. And this is for the first set already for Madars Razma. Someone shouted out, they were trying to encourage him, but that's sensible. Just composes himself, he has two darts at tops for the set. 20. Almost talks himself out of that second one. Jimmy, you require 16. So a couple of eights, three darts at it to hold throw Jamie Hughes. And get the fourth seed on the board in the last 16. Oh, he's missed his first five shots of the double. 
12. Make that a half dozen. Manager required 14. Right, quiet everyone. Maddars needs to concentrate. And there, there it is. Let's be sure with the first set. Manager Osman. Second set, first lap. It's Manager Trophers. Game on. A set against the darts, two breaks of throw from the Latvian. Forty-one. There's plenty to ponder early on for Jamie Hughes. Sense the buzz inside the lakeside tonight. All kinds of forty-nine. Attire, fancy dress. We were treated in the interval between matches to half a dozen penguins doing the Macarena. One hundred and thirty-four. They're both having issues with their scoring, especially at the start of the leg for Jamie Hughes. Have a look at that. With his first nine darts, that one forty just scrapes him into the 70s he was down at 67 before that hello one on an m14 madars with a ton plus with his first nine that's fine that's acceptable that's good will jamie stay down he Nine will just six. flicks off the barrel Sixty-five. So Rasma on a finish. Jamie very much not. Sixty. Malajiri Gua one hundred and twenty-one. Forty-four. Disappointed Jamie with that. 156. Needs something to get him going, and this would be that something if he could do it. He's not looked happy since the walk-on. Questioned whether the board was straight, and then really hasn't got well, going. That's 40. more like it. A yeah, couple of ton forties from Jamie in this leg. Eighteen now for tops. One dart at it. For Madars, Rasma, and a fourth leg in a row, he's missed it. Jimmy, you require 16. Doubles aren't flowing quite as well as they did in his first round match. So, charge right, for Jamie Hughes to get time. on the board, and Jimmy he takes Hughes. it. Second lap is Jimmy the top first. And another leg against the darts. Three of the four legs so far have been breaks of throw. Perfect start for Jamie. 100. Oh, blimey. That's a party trick. Groucho darts. 113. Well, Jamie's first nine darts have been eyebrow raising so far. 16. <laughs> Highlight of the match so far. <laughs> kind of is. Sixteen. Unable to find any consistency so far. He did get the adjustment that he requested regarding whether 16. or not the board was straight. If it wasn't, it wasn't a million miles off, but it was adjusted. Doesn't really help matters. One hundred. Trina Gulliver. 
She's won nine world titles. Would dearly love to make it ten. One on the end, oh, just missed the treble 17, straight into the treble two. One on the own, 14. Monitor require 85. Better darts from Jamie, but he may not get back. 85 for Rasma. 20 leaves a shot at Bull. One dart at Bullseye. 16. Jamie, you require 41. So, nine. Double 16. He hit double eight in the last leg. 25. He's missed it there. Oh dear, one of nine on doubles. 25. 17 leaves double four for one leg goal, second set, leading by a set to nil. Double two. Miles on. What's happened? Jamie, you require 16. To the Madars Rasma that could barely miss a double in the last round. Another miss from Jamie Hughes. Last dart, last Eight. chance, no. One from 12 on the double. Four. They're both struggling badly here. Yeah, let's keep short in the second round. It's Monaco's one. Third leg is Monaco's one. 22nd dart of the leg. Game on. And another break of throw. Jamie Hughes hasn't held yet. Oh, oh yes! No, 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 that will get them going at the same time. It's exactly what the match needed. Go on. One of the end, 21. Thought about going in the treble 20, that first time, and just chose to drop south of the wire. Unlucky. And he had to adjust and come down because he would have knocked the first dart out. So precarious was its lie. Nice second dart from Hughes. And One the on third. The 14. This is more like it, Jamie. They're both getting a little off put by ill timed shouts from the crowd. One hundred. Mother should require one hundred and forty. So two treble twenties, double ten. To hold his throw. Very unlucky. 18. Jamie, you require 114. So the same shot for Jamie Hughes. Oh, he's straight into the treble five. Look of anguish. Big seven. What are you doing, he says to himself. How about the third? Big 23. Manas who requires 16. 20 and tops for Rasma. <laughs> 14. Jamie Uruguay 117. Jamie Hughes would dearly like to make him pay for that. Treble 20. Leaves single 17 for a dart at tops. For another break of throw. I'm He's pulled seven. it. So double I'm 10 20. to hold and move ahead. Second set. Two tens for Madras Ras, but no mistake. The Middle of the bag. Four luggers, Jamie to throw first. Keep on. So I mentioned. 15 minutes or so ago, 
that Jamie Hughes was struggling so much with his first nine darts that he was averaging in the 60s. He's turned that round, rather. Normally happens when you say something like that, Vassos. Almost always. Nice visit as well from Madas Rasma. The Scottish classic champion. The man from Latvia. Forty-one. Eighty-five. Great job. 96. Well, he's not managed it 81. yet, Jamie Hughes, but he must hold his throw here, or he's two sets down. Well, he'll be on a finish when he comes back. One on an fourteen. Rasmus way back at 235, make that 234. Needs another. 62. Not another one though. Team you require 84. So 84 for a first hold of throw. Treble 16 would leave double eight. That's what he went for. It'll have to be another big 16. 62. He'll be back for 32. He's yet to hit double 16, so a bit of pressure could be applied here. 55. Jimmy, you require 32. Double 16. Show over the fourth line. Jimmy, you. Fifth line is Morrison to first. Game on. Only his second successful double in 14 attempts. Jamie Hughes. Fifty-eight. Trying to get himself going. So there's a break after this leg of darts. Jamie will be thinking, if I can pull something out of the bag this leg and go in one apiece, we can just start again. In the context of the match, you hardly need me to tell you that this is an important leg. 100. 2 0 and 1 all in a race to four are very different scorelines. And Rasma has the darts. 100. I think it was just off camera, but just while Jamie Hughes was throwing there, Madar's Rasma just crouched down onto his haunches. 100. I don't know why he did that. Yeah, not the first time he's done that. Maybe just composing himself. Just what Jamie needs to do here, because he's... Oh, yes, he needed that final dart. There's Matters. Just had a little crouch down. And a spring up. Ninety-seven. Okay then, Madars. Over to you when you're back at the hockey with one four six for a two-set lead. Jamie Hughes. Back up to the twenties. Finds a treble. Needed that. One on the end one. Madars require one hundred and forty-six. This for a two-set lead. Oh, unlucky. I thought it out. was in. <laughs> it isn't. So it'll be 17s on this one. 56. 
Team Uruguay 158. Now then. Oh, there's one of them. Needed a second. One of them, 34. Very, very, very crucial Manus moments Uruguay, in this 19. match. Coming right up. Yeah, he's given himself a chance if Maris slips up, but that's a terrific first dart. Double 15 for a two-set lead for the world number 18. No, no for Maris Rasmus. What a chance for Jamie Hughes. Jamie Hughes, 24. This to pull level at one apiece. It'll feel like a lead. One dart at double six for the set. Yeah, it's getting shot in a seven shot. Jamie well, what an important moment in the match. It looked as though Jamie Hughes was suffering the darting blues, but he's pulled it out, and we go to the break level of one apiece. Jamie charged up the stage there. He got out of jail too. It's early days, and it's one all at the early exchanges. This match is still on the launch pad. We're hoping for takeoff when the players return. Game because Maddars is a bit of a bit of a smiler and he enjoys himself up there. And this is now crucial. Jamie Hughes needs to try and get his A game here. Back to Bassus and George. Didn't look at all happy, uh, did he? Jamie Hughes throwing darts at the boards in the practice room. But, uh, well, the atmosphere inside the arena has been slightly more upbeat. Have a look at this. <laughs> this is a conga to Amarillo featuring Luigi from Super Mario and Kiss. And if you notice, Kiss gets towards the bar. Turn, I think it's actually, I'd rather Tom go for a drink. Came on. <laughs> <laughs> Ninety-three. Fifty-five. Tony O'Shea, I know, thinks that Jamie Hughes is throwing a little slower than normal. And Madars Rasmus well, before the match. Told me that he was looking forward to playing Jamie because he throws quickly. Well, if Madars has been telling everyone that, maybe Jamie got to hear about it and thought, I know, I'll slow down a bit and it'll affect Madars' rhythm. It's kind of worked as well. 95. Also during the break as Jamie was hammering the practice board with the disdain looking like a, a kid had just been told he was grounded for a month and while the uh, conga was going on we had three or four officials on stage just checking that the board oh, was no. okay and level Jamie having questioned it right at the start of the match it seemed to be okay 96 Team you require 78. Twenty in tops then. To hold his throw at the start of the third set. My goodness me, who's favourite for this match from here? 38. Monas you require 135. Ball to start. Oh, absolutely perfect. Treble 15 for double top. For a 1-3-5. Can you, Maras? No. Oh, 15. Jamie, you require 14. Same bit of the board for Jamie Hughes. The top bit. Not that high. And it's been shot with the first line. Jamie Hughes. Second line gets the double ten. Game on. 
finds a way to win the leg again. First lead Indeed. of the match as well. Hello, Sailor. Look at those averages. Jamie Hughes started so quietly, couldn't find the trebles. Madars Rasma in the first two sets. Well, much of a muchness. Yeah, much better from Jamie, second set. Fourteen. We just had word from the BDO, the organisers of this World Championship, that, yes, the board was level, is level, continues to be Ball level. In 14. It's all fine. Unless many more people start doing the conga, <laughs> than the dozen or so we saw during the last break will be fine <laughs> uh, Madar's waiting on 121 to hold throw for one apiece 42 one set of 121 so treble 20 treble 11 14s treble 17 still leaves a shot here when he would have left a bullseye 85 well, look how far back Jamie Hughes is How much can he eat into this 290? Well, 63 of them. 83. What is required? 36. Two 18s to level the set and level the match. Oh, his no finishing's score. completely gone. Well, they've both thrown 21 darts at a double. Four have landed for Hughes. Five for Rasma, who was 10 of 16 in his last round. 79. Really That's a good last six. start. Might not mean anything though if Madars can take out two 18s. Bends the top of the wire twice. Has a breather. This one has to land. 18. Missed it six so times. Nah, just the wrong side of the wire, and that's unlucky. Can't now finish. Thirty-three. Monitor require 18. Okay, seventh chance, Madars, to win this leg. He's gone for 10 double four. Ah, oh, would you believe no it? Score. Didn't fancy it at all. Yoz's wife, Jane. Now, can he take out 95? Bullseye leaves 13, double 16. For a steal. 79. No. Well, that's require 18. Ninth chance. He's going for the double nine this time. One for double though, four. Did he? Tenth started a double. No. 14. Still no. Team, you require 16. Well, it's a problem. It's a big problem now. 18% both on checkouts, nowhere near good enough. Yeah, That's more like it's a top race for Jamie Hughes. Jamie Hughes. Hughes moves too clear. Third like set. Come 
So coming into the match, we were all talking about how Madars Razma couldn't be given too many darts at the double because he just doesn't miss. 10 from 16, 67% in his first round match. Look at him today. 5 from 28. And he missed 10 chances to win that second leg. 56. He's missed his last 12 darts at a double, Brasma. One on the 37. Good last start, solid visit from Jamie Hughes. Madar strays into the treble five, twice. 15. What he's doing here, Madar's Razma, is playing Jamie Hughes into a bit of form. Yeah, and the pace has picked up from Yotta 82. as well. And it's working for him. Big momentum shift. Whoa. And maybe another one. Hello. It happens so often in this wonderful game of darts. One maximum responded to instantly. Oh, he's not going to go for another. Not from 215. But those are three more. Perfect darts. Nine in a row. This could quieten things straight away, though. Double nine for the set. Not this time, Jamie. No score. Might as well no, bust himself. 38. So for a break of throw, will he go six six? Yes, he will. Six double sixteen. Yeah, First King shot. Man of last time. Four like his man of the throw first. Game on. That must feel good after twelve misses in a row. So he's actually hit a ton eighty, a one seventy seven, and then double One sixteen hit first time. Two ton eighties for the match for Madars Rasmus One four for the 40. competition. Well, there was a bit of nonsense at the start of the match when Jamie didn't think the board was straight and Madars just wandered off, but it's definitely been One played in a 34. decent spirit as this. Players acknowledging each other in between legs. Touch of the fist. I'll tell you what, we mentioned Jamie sped up, I think. Rasmus picked up the pace too. And the result is we're seeing much better darts. And now we're going to see another ton 80. Not this time. So 147. You'd like this in snooker every day of the week. What about at the lakeside? Treble 17. 97. But this Jamie is set point again. Just feel he should have just carried on there. The force was with him. Treble 17 for Bull. He's left accidentally and can't now finish. 14. Three really one, two, good visits five, from Jamie 15. Hughes. A 1, 2, 3, a 1, 3, 4 and a ton 40. Just paused. Anyway, double 16 for Razmar to level the set. 18. Timmy, you require 64. Set point again. Treble 16, 16, double eight is the two data. And again, Jamie Hughes waits. It's going to have to be 16, double 16 now. One dart at it for the set for Jamie Hughes. 48. The eyes close, and, and the chance goes. 32. I thought he was better when he was quick. 216 for Razma, yes. Yeah, the set is level. The match is level. Fifth flag is team in the first.
Another big moment coming up. Who's going to win this leg? Who's going to win this set? Jamie has the darts. And you're right. He picks up the pace. 16. Started to nail the trebles and the doubles. And then got a bit serious, started to pause. And he's left the door open and Razmar said, thank you very much, I will pop in if you don't mind. Twenty-five. Ninety-five. It's Hughes with the advantage of the darts in this leg. He's only held throw twice in six attempts. Fifty-one. It's three from six for Madars. None of that matters, really. Just whoever wins this leg. One hundred. Moves ahead in sets. Yeah, the break definitely benefited Jamie Hughes. He went in one apiece, but in all truth, could have been 2 0 down. 95. Threw a succession of very angry darts in the practice area, in the bar, and we're seeing much better play now. 2 4 6 plus these. 16. Hasn't left the finish. But Rasmus, miles away. 95. So Jamie will be first to a finish. He's already had one dart for the set. I'll go for the ball here. Treble 10 though. 150. Very nice darts. Terrific three darts. He's going to have all the time in the world at 36. 65. Well, it leaves Jamie Uli by 36. 170, but will he get a shot? Double 18. 41. Well, all around they enjoy the odd bit of booze. <laughs> Plenty of that in here tonight. 100. But impeccably behaved as they always are here at the darts. Sixty. Could be a trip to the barbers in the morning, sir. This is pride and joy. <laughs> Sixty. Well, you maybe heard me put the hat on. Vassos has gone. <laughs> 23. Oh dear. 2 1 Jamie Hughes. This is the start of set number four. Forty-one. You can't look shy when the camera's on you if you dress like that. Good darts. Oh, Brilliant darts, Jamie Hughes. Still throwing angry, isn't he? It's working, he's got the bit between his teeth at the 42. moment. Team Uli requires 66. Pacing up and down. Five for double eight, he's hit treble 15 there. No, you really have. <laughs> Still have. Five for double eight. Loud applause from Jane. One hundred. Forty-two. 
41. And that's Robert with the grey hair, his manager. 100. Jamie's manager, that is. Already 160 odd ahead. He's better from Maddars. Yes! Just when you think he's struggling, he does one of those. Well, he is still struggling. Needs a couple more visits like that, Madars Rasma. Just not backing it up at the moment. That's a good final dart. Now, that one definitely is not natural hair. They're more safe on that one, aren't they? Yours are on a finish, but Madars will be favourite for the leg after this. One hundred and twenty-five. Team Uruguay, one hundred and thirty. Well, that leaves the bullseye. One on the five. Unlucky. Monetary by 55. You sense he needs this. Big 15. Double top. One from 70 up here. Make that one from eight. 15. Jamie, you require 25. Right, big nine. Double eight for Jamie Hughes. Two fours. Oh, he's got it. Uh, it's in the second one. Jamie Hughes. Third luck is Madison Trophies. Came up. Could be a big dart that. Jamie holds his throw and moves to within one, one, and 20 one leg of a 3 1 lead. Looked for all the world like he was going two sets down. Shows how important it was playing badly to go into that first break level pegging at one apiece. That would have felt like a lead for Jamie Hughes. 18. And he could just dust himself down, throw a few angry ones in the practice room, come back, start again. Play first to three. Got the release wrong there. Didn't he? How's your release? One hundred. I'd say quite a lot inferior to what we're seeing here. Mind you, that wasn't great. That was eighteen. I actually played a lot of darts. I lived in France for a year. Played a lot of the electronic darts down the local pub. One on the Soft tip darts, the electronic machine, which actually did all the calculations for you. So that helped my well, substandard GCSE mathematics. It's good, good to hear that actually. Rasmus on the finish. One hundred sixty-six. One sixty-six. To level this setup, nine for double sixteen now. Yes. Yeah, this came short in the third line. Where did that one come Wilson. from? Four matches, Jamie the top first. Game on. Alima finally has something to shout about. Fifty-eight. But this is Jamie Hughes throwing first. 66. For that 3 1 lead. Great first start. 
plenty of room in the bed for another one of those. Holland 21. Very deliberate that second dart. And that third. Great stuff from Jamie. Got a big lead here. 59. Whitby Town FC, the Seasiders. Great to have you down at the lakeside. 60. Well, only 60, but he's well clear unless Madars can find a big visit here to apply some pressure. He started off well. Needs another. Gets another. Jamie Uriquai, 128. Okay then. Business end of this leg. But treble 20 leaves the bullseye. 63. Monitor Uriquai, 114. Now then, Madars, can we nick this one? We can't. But a treble here. 100. Leaps double top and pressure. Jamie, you require 65. This 65. He'll aim for and hope not to hit the ball. Unlucky. So 15 for ball now. Treble would have left double 10. And they will aim for the ball. And hope against hope that he does hit it. So Rasma, monitor required 14. Three darts at tops have not been his friend. Double 10. Refocuses. Fires and misses. 20. Well, frankly, Jimmy, you require 25. He had his chance. It is 3-1 to the fourth seed. He is one more set away from a place in the quarterfinals. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. Do you know what? It's lovely up on stage. They're acknowledging each other's successes. And trading blows. One on the end, 13. Now this was at the end of that fourth set. A lot of respect there. 16. Jamie helping up Madaz, who, who was back on his haunches again. Taking stock of a three sets to one deficit. 19. Well, the thing is, Madars Razma had three darts in his hand and 40 left on the score sheet. The way he was finishing against Gary Robson, you to put the mortgage on him. Ninety-seven. Jamie, you require one hundred and thirty. So one thirty. Treble 20 would leave one dart at a ball. 94. Oh, great last dart. No, just not happening for him. 44. Jamie Hughes required 36. So two 18s for Jamie Hughes. Yeah, one dart required. Jamie 
And the fourth Second seed line, starting to Bowman. flex his lakeside Game muscles. Bowman. Hello. Oh. Hello. Second leg in a row, we've begun perfectly. One hundred. Go on, look at it. Well, he knows quite rightly it's pretty much now or never, Madars Rasma. Three one down. First of four, having taken the opener. 16. Could perhaps should have been 2 0 up. Let's have a look at the finishing set by set. 16. That was set four. Big improvement from Jamie Hughes. Madars continues to struggle. But if you 16. want real struggles, Madars Rasmar in set three was two from 15. Including 96. 12 misses in a row. He's got a healthy advantage here though. Jamie not doing much to change that with these three darts. So 82. 82. He might go bull, he might go treble 14. Let's have a look. Went bull. So 17 would leave tops now for Madars Rasma. 42. It's not happening for him, is it? One out of 12 on tops for the Latvian. He will have three more goes. 25. Manager you require 14. Oh, it's just not happening, is it? So easy 13. in the last round. So, Jimmy, so difficult this round. And do you know what? Those double beds have not got smaller. Jamie could steal this now. Great start. Treble 19 for double 12. For a break of throw. 170. Great effort. What does he require? 10. I thought he'd get that. Well. So he's going to go straight for the double five. Yeah. And that's Eight misses in a row before that double five. Fourteen. And only forty from Jamie Hughes throwing first. Just needs to hold his throw twice. One hundred. And he's through to the quarterfinals. But he won't do that with many more visits like that 40. He's slowed down again, hasn't he? Neither of these two have tasted a lakeside quarterfinal. 100. Well, I know you like keeping 59. notes about these things, but we're about halfway through the tournament and we have had 18,850 darts thrown at Lakeside this year. That's quite a tally chart you've kept there, Passos. 24! I do very little else, and I don't get out much. <laughs> that was unfortunate. Hasn't been a vintage leg from either. Hughes crucially has the darts. He might stay 18s, I think. Oh, he's straight into the four. 
and then into the one. Little chuckle. Made his debut last year, Jamie Hughes. 57. Lost to Glenn Durant in the second round. Nearly got here twice before. Reached the final qualifying round in 2012 in Hull, but was controversially, I think, timed out before his match against Andy Bolton, who automatically progressed. And then reached the final qualifying round again in Hull in 2013, but lost to Dave Prince. 96. Jimmy, you require 95. None of that will be going through his mind right now, though, as he lines up for 95. Bullseye was the start. 20. For another crack of Bullseye. 70. Unlucky. Monitor require 164. Just flicks the wire. So 164 for Madars Rasma. Won't be happening. And is he poised to go 2 1 down and within Jimmy, a leg of defeat? We know it goes 9 double eight. Won't want to give Rasma a chance 21. at Shanghai. But has done. Big moment this, big opportunity to break the throw. Needs a treble. Doesn't get it. One hundred. Does now. Team, you require four. So four for a two-one lead, and to move within one leg of a place in the quarterfinals. Jamie Hughes. Yeah, Jamie Hughes. Four leg is Madison from first. And that voice you can hear above all others at Lakeside is that of Jamie's wife, Jane. 22. What a chance here for Jamie Hughes. This awful first visit from Rasma needing to hold to stay in this year's championship. And only 22. 45. That's not a great deal better, is it? More than twice as good. <laughs> Needs to find the treble. It's deserting him at the moment. 16. We're not seeing any razzmatazz from Maras Razma. Big visit here. Could really do some damage. 100. Tell you what, he meant those last two, didn't he? 14. Threw his shoulder into those like a, a forward, in a rugby tackle. Sort of pity the dartboard a bit here. Twenty-six. Look at this. Have some of that, he says. Rasma hasn't found a treble yet. Before that treble 19, he hadn't. 81. Remember, he must hold, or he's out. Yeah, not a classic leg this from either. Rasma with the darts, no real advantage. Finally, a treble from Jamie. Puts a little bit of pressure on. Good response, though. 84. Wesley Harms awaits the winner. And he's been in watching as well, Wesley, tonight. Attends as much as he can, still very much a student of the game. And above all, a huge fan of darts. 44. Jamie, you require 135. So this is for the match for Jamie Hughes, the fourth seed. A couple of times he's done this. Oh, he starts with a ball. So treble 15 for tops. 
treble 18 and Rasma. Well, this would be some way to extend the match. It's there for Hughes, unless Rasma can take this out. Another one of those for Bullseye to stay in the World Championship. And boys in the crowd want to see this one land. Bullseye could very well be his last dart. No! 37. So, Two uniform and 16. Double eight for Jamie Hughes. This is for the match. Good. And so, there it is. Good match to you. The fourth seed will taste a lakeside quarterfinal for the very first time. A slow old start from Jamie Hughes, but in the end, Hughes will cruise into the last eight. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as the players leave the stage, Latvia's Manos Rosma. But into the quarterfinal, it's the boy from the Black Country, Yoza Jamie.